Oh, good morning. On this episode of Cooking with Squirrel, we're going to be making clarifying butter similar to the ghee style. Let me get changed and we'll get started. So we're going to clarify butter in the ghee style. I say the ghee style because we're going to evaporate the water out of it, but we're not going to allow it to brown. So normally I do two pounds of butter at a time. Uh, however, since I've already got about a quarter of my container full and just but unsalted butter ends in pieces, we're going to only do what I have uh, this time. Like I said, normally it's two pounds at a time because my little five-eighths of a quarter butter warmer will hold two pounds along with my container. Uh, let's get started. We'll go ahead and uh, get the burner turned on oh about mid and start uh, putting these pieces in. So as our butter's melting we're just adding more and uh, so as our butter melts and allows more, us to add more to the our little butter warmer that's what we're going to do. Now that our butter has melted what we're going to do is boil off the water. It's a basic chemical uh, chemistry uh, principle that uh, your temperature of a substance won't raise until the impurity has, has been removed. In this case, the butter will not burn until the water has boiled off. What's going to happen is the water is going to boil off. The white milk fat is going to drop to the bottom. As soon as it drops to the bottom, we're going to pull it off and strain it into our container. And that's the difference between a traditional ghee. Traditional ghee, you'd allow it to brown and give the butter a, a, a more nutty flavor. But all I want is clarified butter. Now that, that the butter has basically quit boiling and just foaming, we're going to remove it from the heat, strain it through uh, some cheesecloth and a fine mesh strainer. I hope you have enjoyed watching this as much as I have enjoyed making this. If I can make this in my kitchen, what can you make in yours? Like, comment, share, subscribe. Thank you for your time.